Uh, established in 1970, the King's Head in Islington was the first London pub with a theatre since Shakespearean times, but soon to be no more, as the productions will be moving to a new development nearby. Alice Sawfield has the story. A man, a flat, a car, and now a houseboy. He's not a houseboy, he's a cleaner. Actually, he's not even a cleaner, he's an actor. An actor! But make no mistake, the actors who've trod the boards here are no joke. All of the great and good have kind of started their career here, often in this tiny room at the back of a pub. Um, so whether it's Joanna Lumley or Alan Rickman. And now, after 47 years at its landmark location in a pub on Upper Street, the company is set to move. And distance-wise, it's really not very far that they're moving. This building here is the current dressing room of the King's Head Theatre. And if you look over here, this will be the box office entrance to the brand new building. From next autumn, it'll be housed in a purpose-built venue in the new £400 million Islington Square development. It'll have a 250-seat auditorium, as well as a smaller studio and a bar. Your anniversary. We haven't talked about it. We've got to do something. What can we do? Lee Knight is currently performing in his first play at the pub theatre and is looking forward to the new opportunities. The arts are always under pressure and I think that having uh, a new space, something so exciting, two theatres, um, can only be great for actors and the work, they're going to be creating more work, there's going to be more jobs, more jobs for people behind the scenes. The executive director of the theatre says it's all about keeping the doors open. Our history is wonderful and this building holds a lot of memories for a lot of people um, but it's not sustainable and the truth is that this move means the King's Head Theatre will survive. I hope it doesn't change the ambience that's already in there because you feel um, sort of the, the buzz that's already created. We only come for the theatre so you know, yeah we, we have a drink when we come but uh, no I don't think it would change much. The pub will remain and the old theatre space will be turned into a dining room, whilst the new theatre hopes to continue its legacy of launching the careers of London's actors. Alice Solfield, BBC London News.